टू दर एम एल एस बोथ बीजेपी एंड टी डी पी आई डिसाइडेड टू नॉमिनेट मी वोट वोट फॉर मी एज अ मेंबर ऑफ पार्लियामेंट फॉर राज्यसभा फ्रॉम अ ग्रेट स्टेट लाइक आंध्र प्रदेश एज वी नो इट इज वन ऑफ द मोस्ट डायनामिक स्टेट्स इन द कंट्री फास्ट प्रोग्रेसिंग अंडर द लीडरशिप ऑफ अनदर डायनामिक चीफ मिनिस्टर मिस्टर चंद्रबाबू नायडू सो वी आर वेरी होपफुल दैट वी टुगेदर विल बी एबल टू बिल्ड अ मॉडर्न आंध्र प्रदेश बाय कोलैबोरेशन विथ ऑल द स्टेक होल्डर्स पर्टिकुलरली आई एम वेरी हैप्पी दैट दो आई एम नॉट बॉर्न इन आंध्र प्रदेश आई वॉज अ मेंबर ऑफ पार्लियामेंट फोर टाइम्स फ्रॉम महाराष्ट्र लोकसभा वन टाइम फ्रॉम नॉर्थ हरियाणा and this is my now from andhra pradesh which is the southern state so in two sense of the term i belong to the country and now i come back to a place where i think we can do a lot together i know i am not only a railway minister of india so i'll not going to speak about railway because today we are in the process of election but i will also be a member of parliament so not just railway minister so as a member of parliament all long development of andhra pradesh is very paramount and important i had already had a discussion with honorable chief minister and he also is saying we must work together we are very lucky to have a prime minister like narendra modi who is already trying to bring about an all round development sabka saath sabka vikas is a theme of a development and in that a dynamic state which is going to be the partner and we always know that development of state is development of india so if andhra pradesh develops at a accelerated pace india will also grow at a faster pace so we look forward to that i am very happy that not only my colleagues friends mlas leaders karyakartas has supported but also the citizens of the state by sending so many communication so i am thankful to all of them and also thankful to all the media i think andhra pradesh must be the state where there is a maximum media i can see that yeah. <laughs> i think i am very happy and looking forward to overwhelm support from all of you thank you very much i told you today is nothing that i can tell you because we are in the process of election but as i said all round development of state which includes infrastructure which includes human development index development which includes economic growth but also social development Thanks. fine the yeah. 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 minister you cannot talk but as an mp you can talk right yes yeah. as an mp you can talk right no. so then i become when i become mp i will talk about it <laughs> okay uh, especially so i have also thankful to as i said our great leader chandrababu naidu venkai ji naidu for really reposing tremendous faith and time to work together sir uh, yes. sir as far as andhra pradesh is concerned there is a specific issue Out of 13 districts of Andhra Pradesh, nine districts are disaster zones. So there is a special need for Andhra Pradesh to be treated specially. So it seems for the last two years, despite the repeated request by the Chief Minister, and despite showing that 10.5 percent of the growth rate, hardly anything uh, is coming from the sector. You know, How, as an you. MP after election, you wanted to address this issue? As an MP, it's an obligation of all of us to articulate, represent. champion advocate for all the issues related to the state so we will definitely continue to do that we are very lucky to have a chief minister who always keeps articulating the concerns of the state and we have a very good prime minister who always listens to the concerns of the state, all state so we'll work together we'll address issues despite several challenges country is facing because of the previous ten years of problem that india has faced we are trying to take the country out of it we are trying to put it on a fast track of development and having state as a partner will accelerate the growth even further <laughs> so yeah particular to the market